Hi guys, Ryan here from Advanced Physical and Aquatic Therapy, hashtag Advance Your Health video project. Today, the topic is MRI findings and how it affects your perception of pain um, or if you have any dysfunction um, or issues with your low back, spine, things of that nature. Um, so this is a research article that has a graph that accompanied it. The graph is the percentage of abnormal findings on lumbar spine, MRI, and CT images in healthy, pain-free subjects. So as you can see in the graphic, that as you age, 20s, 40s, 60s, 80s, the likelihood of you having a disc bulge, disc degeneration, disc protrusion, facet degeneration, or a spondylolisthesis increases as you age. These are all in people that are healthy, pain-free. So the point to this is, is as you age, things are going to degenerate in your spine and not necessarily have you, cause you to have any pain or dysfunction in your life. Um, so people come in and with their MRI and they have pain in their back and they say, wow, my doctor told me that this MRI is show, showing a disc bulge and it almost gives them the impetus to have a perception of more pain like hey I should have more pain because look at I have a disc protrusion I have a disc bulge but all these people as they age are all going to have that as well and be pain free so it doesn't actually correlate for an MRI to say that you have this going on in your back for you to have that type of pain a lot of the pain tends to be muscular and uh, functional in nature so in other words, you don't have enough range of motion, you don't have enough core strength to stabilize your spine, and these are all things that physical activity and physical therapy can help with. So I hope that sheds some light on MRI findings and how it pertains to your pain. Um, and that's it for today. I will talk to you guys next time.